I know him. Let him in. Hey. Hey. I got those parts that you asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yeah? Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah, Boozer's one of us now. Good to see you, Deke. Buzz. Your bike's drained, Deke. Need fuel? Sure. All right. Stop by any time. Worked at the Humane Society, had a small office and a dog pen outside of Sisters. <coughs> had maybe a hundred dogs, strays mostly. A few had owners who would show up eventually. And one of the guys brought in a sick collie. It was a beautiful dog, but I told him to take it to our vet. We couldn't let her in, but the vet had no room, so we kept her. I didn't even know dogs can get infected. Like, people, I mean. No one knew, I guess. An hour later, she was rabid. Like, worse than that. Her fur started falling out. She just turned. We had to put them all down. And there was nothing else we could do. It was so horrible. You know what's messed up? That's not the worst story I've heard. Not even close. Deek, Deek. <laughs> What's been keeping you away so long? There you are looking fine today. Hey, Deek, you there? I've got Boozer's new prosthetic ready. I asked Addy to find him and send him over. Uh, great. Great, Ricky. I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. Okay, got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go, that's better. Okay. Hey, brother. 
Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, well, that was all Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, it could have been one of those, those yeah. three goddamn musketeers. Hung guard, you <laughs> fucking ripper. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, maybe this wasn't that good of an idea? Maybe. Damn it. Okay. St. John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. O'Brien, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I need you. Yes, I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last job. Were you listening to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene. Right? Sarah Irene Whitaker? It's on her admission form. One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey, you're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skiz, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? I'll tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Headed. Farewell. Over toward Malakwa Lake. Uh, you know where that is? Training. Yeah, it's no. just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo fast, Road. Fast. So what are we doing there? It wasn't. A Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So O'Brien, he's uh, he's what? Your your shot caller, handler? No. Jesus, Boozer. You know why the hell we're out here? Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump. You ask how high. It's not how it is. How you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. I spent summers working the beet fields. That little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. Sight, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. 
Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. Right behind you. I haven't heard that for a while. Yeah. There it is. Jesus. I thought I'd see one of those again. In the air, I mean. All right, now watch. Soldiers come out first, they secure the LZ. Then their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, comes out, he looks around. What? Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? Wait here. Stop or oh, we'll shoot! We could be friends now, can't we?
Catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money, and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing, or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south, and with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished. Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole. You wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. Oh, Brian said he had news. He knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? I was willing to do some digging through some files that, we, that they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, O'Brien. No anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was in, admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she's... Yeah, uh, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of Jamal. Okay, so... So she could still be alive. Even after all this time, she could still be alive, you're saying? No. What do you mean, no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 look. There was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected... Freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel. The soldiers. The guys with the guns. The guys that should have been protecting no, no, the there's civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. All They're about hordes. Oh, they right. know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope, there was no time, there was no room, okay? There was, we had already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. Look, I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand. If you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You 
did the right thing. <laughs> you know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. saving her life that night. So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things a waste of my goddamn time. Boozer! Boozer! Oh, God damn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, right. Booze, man, where the hell did you go? Tracks. It's gotta be his. Gotta take a closer look. What the hell is this? What do we got? Uh, this way. St. John. Ah, uh, yeah. Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. He said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. You still in? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, just the... Great. Let me know when. I can feel that hot water now. Gonna let that shower run forever. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's that. It sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go. All right, Deacon out. Which way? Back on track. Over here! Oh, Jesus, Boozer, what the hell? I figured I'd do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. He's not infected. He's, he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just, no, we can't, we can't leave him here, Deke. Uh, we just, we can't, we can't do it here. Here, let me, uh, let me do it. Really? You, you can. Okay, boy. Okay, easy. It's okay. All right, just hold oh, it. Jesus, D. It's okay. okay, just, that's it. All right, it's okay, big guy. Rest.
You ready? Oh yeah, brother. I'm ready. Are you okay? Yeah. I think that's the last of them. Oh, you sound disappointed. Well, I just... I hate those sons of bitches, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Let's, uh... Let's get the hell out of here. So what the hell happened back there? You seem sort of... I don't know. Like, uh... Like you lost it. Uh, I don't know. I guess I just... I needed some payback for this shit, but, uh, there's never gonna be enough payback, is there? You know? If you hadn't made this shit for me, you know, my arm, I mean, I don't know where I'd be. I, mean, I guess I... I know. You know. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, not like I got a choice. Not like any of us do, right? Yeah, okay, come on. Okay. Hey, there's your bike. Hey, how'd it go? Oh, uh, what go? You know, goddamn well, your guy in the space suit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddammit. Loser, you really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrawny little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? Stay down, brother. Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah. And she's been dead a long time. So don't you think that you mourned her long enough? You have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> Come on, man. I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camp ain't gonna feed itself. Okay. It's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Fucking shameful. <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still got to work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's, it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay.
So, she died that night. And there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. And what good would that have done? Just drop it, it's done. Skizzo, you there? Lost Lake Camp, Skizzo. Yeah, yeah, what's up? We just had a run in with. Hey, where the hell is your bro? We skipped work duty today. What the hell, man? We just, just sh shut up and listen to me. I was giving him a ride to the work site, and we were attacked by rippers. Oh, Jesus. Where? Outside of Rogue Camp. You gotta tell Iron Mike. Carlos is coming, and he is not going to stop. What do you think I've been telling? For months. Yeah, I'll let him know. We're heading toward the Tumalo now. Loser will be at the site in a few minutes. Well, that's great, because he owes the camp another half shift for the work he's missed. Shut up, Skizzo. Hey, Deke. Uh, road camp is kind of in the opposite direction of Tumalo, isn't it? We took the scenic route. Out. Asshole. Goddamn Skizzo. Guys, come on, keep working, keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. That's it. Hey, thanks for the ride. You all start. There you go. Take John to Lost Lake Camp. Come back. Deke, I hear you. Mike, good. Look, Boozer and I, uh, we just had a run-in with Rippers. They... Uh... Rippers? God damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge. Deke, I told you. Well, just listen. No, Mike. They were here, in Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were Rippers in Rogue Camp? You sure it was Rippers? Oh, sure. Oh, Jesus, Mike, yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. Hey, hold on. All right, just calm down. We got a parlay with Carlos. Skizzo's heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. He'll find out what the hell's going on, and then we'll... You're sending Skizzo to parlay with Carlos. Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is gonna hold. Lost Lake out. Now, whatever you say, Mike, whatever you say, Schizo's right. You're gonna get everyone killed. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. What does Nero want? They disappear for two years, come back guns blazing? Don't bother trying to find out. You'll get yourself killed. Besides, we already know.
watching them skulk around. Thinking they know these woods better than me. They're doing something with the freaks. Tracking them. Studying them. Watching them. Making notes in their little notebooks. And you know why? They're gathering info. Seeing how long it takes for these sons of bitches to die or starve off. They're probably trying to get a read on when the feds can re-emerge from their hidey holes and crawl back into their unjust positions of power. For once, the freaks are on our side. Longer they're here, longer the feds can rot down there in their stony prison. The world may not be ours anymore. Thanks to the freaks. It doesn't work out the feds This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Once again, Cope, you don't know shit. Freaks ain't on anybody's side in the world. It already belongs to them. Wait, he's okay. Open up. You here to buy something? How's it going, Buzz? What can I get you? I'll fill her up. Mike's looking pretty busted. That's a good piece. Nice and sturdy. Should have new shit later. Stop by. Hey, I heard a rumor that you're looking for those black choppers. Nero. Is that true? I think I saw one the other night. Yeah, well, you heard wrong. I don't I don't give a damn about Nero or their choppers or anything else. Well, sorry, man. Uh, why so testy about it? I mean. Just drop it, okay? Yep, gotcha. Yeah, see you, Deke. Hey, Deke. How you been? Blair, how you doing? Um, 
Okay. Yep. Hey, Deke. You be careful out there. Hey. What's up with you? That's all I got today. Gonna close my eyes for a bit. All right, okay, let's go. What's up with you? You here to buy something? Be here late. Trying to make forever a day or two, will ya? Get the gate. I'm, uh, I'm heading up to Marion Forks. Marion Forks? What the hell for? Because I decided... Hell, it's like you said, I've, uh... I'm wondering why I'm uh, I'm heading up to hey, Marion Forks. Come on now. Marion Forks. What the hell for? Why don't you try to sign it? Hell, it's like you said. I've uh, wandered long enough. It's, uh, time to say goodbye. You went to the church. Kill him. Kill him. No. Yeah, maybe. Jesus, Deke. <laughs> Time, Boozer, I swear. Deacon out.
You're gonna be okay. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp that... Camp? Where? Where? S show me. I I'll go. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. I, 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 was, I was done for. Holy shit! You know? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh, man. Tell them it was Deacon. They'll know. Don't stop. Just keep out of sight. Vagrants, if they see me, I'm dead. you want I got you now
Let him in. 